Quick overview of using the user interface. The E button is the button that will press to look at various variables. Now the D button, we can that's what we can choose. And the U button will go back. So we were looking at unit um, QV, the units in flow in volume. Volume, SCFH, is volume unit. I'm going to hold the left button. And then when the cursor moves down, hit the U or back, back and forth, these two buttons here. Once you find what you want, CFS, that's pure volume, SCFH is volume as well. And then normal units are, let's look at something like barrels per hour, cubic meters, liters per second, cubic meters per second, that's a common one. Standard cubic feet per per hour, SCFH. So these are the volume units. So I'm gonna long hold, it'll save the units. Now I can go and look at the other variables here. Alarm mode, the flow mode. So gas QV, I'm gonna change it long hold. Let's say we wanna to go to gas in mass. So I'm gonna long hold and we'll go back to the units. See, it's kilograms per hour. So I'm going to go back and turn this to gas QV because I want SCFH. So gas Q, QV, there's volume. And I'm going to go back to flow units, SCFH. So the, this units that are available from here, so the U, this is the standard display, hit it. You can cycle through all these units. There's, there are other variables to be changed, and we want write, write, enable, and you could turn it to write, disable when you're done. And contrast, that's a display, the code. This is the code that you would use to set the other variables you're gonna use, and you do that by changing, um, changing the variables here. So I'm gonna recycle and get to 50. And there are just a few variables that can be changed on this. Once you have it long hold the D. And here we have the signal monitor, meter size. This is a DN25, one inch. Fluid type is gas. And the low flow limit and high flow limit, limit and the amp amplifier. So this is the K factor written on the side of the meter and the pulse factor unit in US gallons and the pulse factor, however you want to set that. So hit the U and I'm going to hit the E again. We're going to be the standard display. I'm going to show you how to change the third line. Long hold the left and we'll show the density, the pressure in kilopascals, the temperature in degrees C, the current up to 4 to 20 milliamps, the percentage, zero to 100% of full scale, the frequency of the raw shedding frequency of the vortex. And this is the most, makes sense. We have pressure, temperature, and flow rate. So we have the multivariables of the multivariable vortex meter. So that's it.